Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying some cold brew lattes, premium coffees from Bones Coffee Company. We have the s'mores, the holy cannoli. Uh, French toast and a fruity cereal. These were $2.98 each at Walmart, but let me tell you this. $2.98 each at Walmart, I looked them up on their website and it's it's honestly ridiculous. A, a lot of times it is with these companies because when you order, you would think ordering from the company, it's going to be cheaper. Mm -hmm. It's not. A 12-pack of these cans is $40. So that's like $3.33 a piece. And we only paid $2.98. Plus, you're going to pay for shipping. You have to pay for shipping from the coffee company. So... If you want to try these, I would highly recommend you uh, try them, uh, get them at Walmart. Yeah, yeah. Okay. And I was looking for like a really good description on, uh, that's why I went to their website because there's no description really on the can. And I thought, oh, I'll get a really good description on the website. It just says s'mores flavor. It says s'mores flavored coffee. S'mores flavored coffee. Yeah, we figured that out. Yeah, pretty much knew that, but there's nothing more we can offer you. Okay. So, uh, s'mores flavored cold brew latte premium coffee. That's that's what you're getting, s'mores flavored. 11 ounces, 325 milliliters is 220 calories. Or if they have caffeine on there. Yes, it yeah. has 255 milligrams of caffeine. Oh, wow, that's like an energy drink. Caffeine contents may vary, not recommended for children, people sensitive to caffeine, pregnant women, or women who are nursing. Shake gently and serve chilled over ice. We have chilled ours because you get them in just the regular, it's where the canned coffees are. Um, so we have kept Like Starbucks ours, and all that stuff. Right, those drinks. So we put <coughs> ours in the refrigerator. They're chilled. Hmm, they, they're cold already. We have shaken them gently, but we're not putting them over ice. The yeah. ice is not going to affect the flavor whatsoever. Um, so it's. I'm surprised it has that much caffeine in it because a traditional coffee is not that much. It would be more like 90 to 100. This is like they've added caffeine to these. They are distributed out of Cape Coral, Florida. Coral. Okay. Coral. Coral. You sound like you said uh, coral. Coral. I know. But the color like, coral. I know. But when you said it, it came out as like coral. Like oh. Walking Dead. When oh, you said coral. 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 <laughs> <laughs> okay. Like. S'mores. Are you going to drink out of there? Out of here? I don't care. Whatever. It smells like a chocolate kind of flavor it smells it better smells like i like the smell better than the, the taste although i don't mind the taste i could drink it it's kind of bitter though which is coffee um but it's it's got a lot of that coffee in the background so but they did sweeten it up quite a bit i think so too it it's um, not bad. No, it, it, it does smell good. Um, i do get where they're going with s'mores yeah i get a little bit of a marshmallowy aftertaste Yes, that's what I'm yeah. getting. But the thing is, if you're used to really sweet coffee, then mm. this might not, like if you're used to these like glorified milkshakes from Starbucks, you might not like this because this is a really, it, it's strong. Yeah, it's a stronger coffee, mm -hmm. a stronger coffee base, that's for sure. Mm -hmm. I don't mind that. Though. I don't mind it. I mean, would I drink it all the time? No. No, but, because the calories are too high. that too. I'm but, shocked at the calories yeah. on these. I really am. Yeah, well it is. It, it does taste pretty sweet. Because I hadn't looked at the calories. <laughs> um, this is the Holy Cannoli. I like that picture. I do too. The it's artwork, the Godfather holding, uh, instead of a cigar, he's holding a cannoli. <laughs> the artwork on all of their boxes is, is uh, yeah, really, really cool. cool. And I think that lures a lot of people into buying. Yeah. Um, it's the artwork. Cannoli yeah. flavored, 210 calories, 255 milligrams of caffeine. Mm -hmm. And we've looked, they sell just like coffee, don't they? Like regular coffee. Yes. Like we've looked, they don't sell them in our area. Well, they sell the pods in, they sell the coffee in World Market. Yeah. But um, you can't, like, they, uh, you have to buy all of one flavor. Right. And we don't, if you and don't, I don't like it. Yeah, if you don't like it, then, you know, you're out of luck. I'm trying to tell what that flavor is. Maybe a, a cream kind of flavor? Yeah, it tastes like mm -hmm. 
a, it, it reminds me a lot of just a creamered coffee, but it's very sweet. Yeah. You still got the underlying like bitterness from the coffee because so they must use a pretty strong coffee. Uh -huh. uh, so you still get that coffee coming through. I don't mind that either. It just tastes like an overly creamered coffee. It's like you almost put too much creamer. Yeah, but I really do like that. It's not bad. If it weren't for those calories, yeah, the then, calories will get you. Then I would drink that because I do like that. Um, and that's the thing about trying them this way. This is a great way to try them. But um, it would be cool to try the 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 K cups because. They don't have calories. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too, though. They're not doctored up like these either. Right. These are doctored up yeah. their way. I would like to try them doctored up our way. Right. So if they sold a, a mix pack or whatever. They do, or... but it's expensive to buy from their company. It's, it's ex expensive to order from the company. And then mm. on top of that, you have to pay for shipping. Right. It's so like, we just haven't done So it. I'm not, yeah. Uh, this and two, you can't pick what flavors you want to put in the variety pack. They give you it's like this, a basic pack. They give you this said variety pack, which some of the flavors are just plain. They're just plain flavors. Well, who wants that? I want to try. You mean all, like just regular roast coffee? Yeah, I want to try all the special ones. I want to have a variety pack with just only special ones. Don't give me regular, you know, regular dark roast or light roast or whatever coffee. I want those special flavors, yes. like these. Yeah. Um, the reason I mention that is because you know we're judging these on the pre-mixed versions of them, so we can't judge the actual coffee. No, no, the coffee, <clears throat> the coffee pot, that the, the uh, they do have like the uh, loose right uh, grounds ground, uh, but yeah, we cannot judge that at all. We can only judge it the way yeah. it, they presented it here. And so far, they haven't been bad. Yeah, this is a French toast flavored. It is 210 calories, 255 uh, milligrams of caffeine. I would think this would have a little cinnamon in it. It may or may not. Mm, I, don't know. I smell oh, vanilla. It does. It has cinnamon. Mm, I just smell the cinnamon too. Actually, I like that one probably the best of all. Really? Mm -hmm. I like that little bit of vanilla flavor. Yeah, it uh, it has a harshness to it for me. Oh no! See, that's the smoothest one of the bunch for me. <laughs> No, not at all. Funny. It almost well. Um, that one doesn't seem to have that bitter aftertaste like the first two did. Oh, okay. Um, to me, it does have a bite to it, no. but it's coming directly from the cinnamon. See, I don't get that much cinnamon. And I think the cinnamon is a harsh cinnamon. It's no. kind of like a really aggressive. Uh, I want to say a dirty cinnamon. It's like just. It's just like um, out of the cabinet cinnamon. Yeah, it's it's. And real, see, I'm getting very little cinnamon. So, but you're just more sensitive to that cinnamon. I am. Than I, than and, I am. and you know, uh, some things I, I want it, and some things I don't. And in that, along with the coffee, the coffee's really bold coffee. Yeah, that's a strong. So coffee. you've got that punch of coffee, and then you've got a another kick of that cinnamon and it's just an overload for me yeah yeah and i'm not i get a little cinnamon but it mine's mostly like the vanilla this sounds really interesting yeah. it's called electric unicorn it is fruity cereal flavored i'm sure it's lemony 210 calories 255 milligrams of caffeine uh yeah you do wonder if it's not going to be lemon because fruity cereal is kind of lemony yes kind of okay flavor Hmm. Didn't really, didn't really smell of anything. Huh. It's very, very artificial. Very artificial. It. Um, you know what though? After the aftertaste is like cereal milk. It like is. you've drank the milk out of the cereal. Uh huh. I just don't enjoy actually drinking it. <laughs> yeah. What cereal are you thinking? Fruit Loops. Or Fruity Pebbles. I'm thinking, fruit, of, I'm thinking Fruity Pebbles. Yeah, those kind of cereals, they're so similar to me. That Fruity Pebbles is so strong. It it's, is strong. It's a very strong flavor. So I'm thinking that's Fruity Pebbles milk Yeah. mixed with coffee. But the bad thing is it kind of settled in as like I drank the milk. Now that it's settled in, really settled in, it's kind of a very artificial chemical-y yeah. flavor. I don't like that one at all. No, no, yeah. not at all. Um, the but, first three, I would, I would, I would, if it was no calorie, I would drink probably any of these three. Yeah, it. Uh, like I said, I, 
I've thought about uh, buying a box from World Market, but I just, I don't want to because I don't want to be stuck with whatever comes in the box. 12. 12. Um, I don't want to be stuck with all those. Or and, buy them and have to give them away to them. Yeah, them. because they're expensive. It is more expensive than other coffee, for sure. And I think a lot of that is uh, you're paying for that artwork too, mm -hmm. uh, paying for that name on it. Um, but my favorite of these would be the Holy Cannoli. This one? Mm -hmm. And you were afraid of that one. You thought that might have uh, some cinnamon in it. Did it did not. I, no, um, I like that one the best. Then I'm going to go for the s'mores. s'mores. See, yeah. I'm going to go French toast, then s'mores, then... No, I'll, I'll go French toast, uh, the cannoli, and then s'mores. But I tell you what, I wouldn't put... Um, we do a, uh, a favorites video, things we hated, things that were our favorites at the end of the month. I can tell you right now, some people watch these videos and they'll see my reaction to this and they'll be like, oh, that's going to be in the hate pile. Well, it's not. And I tell you why, because I still think it, that will, it's what it, it says it is. It is fruity cereal. It's just artificial. It's just artificial. <laughs> yeah. It, it actually does taste like the milk from cereal. So it's not like it was bad quality or anything, yeah. or it tasted like, like it toenails had, or anything. It didn't taste like it had molded or anything yeah. like that. So that wouldn't, I don't hate it, but it's just not for me. Yeah. So. Yeah. I think it's a little too artificial for me. For probably most people. <laughs> yeah, it'll be but, interesting to hear if anybody uh, who yeah. enjoys that. But I don't, I don't, I truly, I don't mind the first three. So. Mm -mm. so I hope you enjoyed the video. I'll have a picture for you at the end. They all look the same, but <laughs> I'll, I'll take a picture for you anyway. And thanks for watching.